Welcome to the EAA uh, Mobility in Munich and welcome to the Renault stand. So we're here today to present the new Megane E-Tech 100% electric. What's really interesting about a fully dedicated uh, electric platform is that you can change the proportions of the cars, make them better. All four wheels can move in the corners, so in terms of proportions, in terms of stance of the car uh, on the road, you know, it looks really uh, amazing. In terms of exterior design, the idea is that an electric car shouldn't be just a technical um, marvel. It should be attractive at first sight. So in terms of design language, well, the idea is to stay true to the Renault uh, root values, basically, of this generous, uh, simple shapes, a very sensual uh, form language, and embed uh, very high-tech details in there. So the front lights, for example, the rear lights, or even the flush uh, door handles on the body side, which also help in terms of aerodynamics. Those are very high-tech, high-quality details, again, embedded into that uh, very slick and interesting form language. So what's very important with an electric car is the aerodynamic performance. Um, of course, unlike uh, petrol cars, it's not a matter of consumption and CO2 emissions, but how far it will go. It's a matter of autonomy. And so we worked aerodynamics on this car a lot. Uh, we have a sloping roof line and the cabin is tapering towards the back, so the aerodynamic performance is as good as possible and on the back there's little features like this one here uh, where the airflow nicely gets off the body of the car. But more important than the exterior because of course you can still fall in love with the exterior of a car and buy it, the interior is where you will spend your life and your daily life experience so let's just get in the car. So in the interior of this car, well the same benefits from the full electrical platform. You see here, there used to be a huge air conditioning unit, which, which you find in every car. And now it's gone under the bonnet of the car. So there's a, a big storage area here. So you have very specific storage to charge your phone wireless here. You have a little phone holder here, but of course also a big storage in here. It's very modular here, but if you remove those little walls here, you have a massive storage area for a handbag. It's as big as possibly uh, a handbag. Now, beyond the storage and the practicality, the physical practicality of the car, the main thing, the masterpiece of this interior is this big 24-inch screen, or double screen in fact, based on Google connected services. So you'd have Google Maps, of course, in there. Uh, the multimedia, the phone obviously, but also the Play Store. The Play Store with uh, Google Assistant and many um, other uh, applications. And in the future this will get richer and richer as we go along and of course all the car uh, features. And what's really important is to make all this very obvious and intuitive for the user to manipulate and understand. So there's very clever direct access to everything no matter where you are, you can access anything very quickly. So the physical storage, the digital content, and of course, about the aesthetics, the materials, you see the dashboard here, the design of the console here, or the door panels, everything is very sharp, lightweight, modern. There's a nice wraparound feeling uh, on the dashboard and the door panels with high-tech content in the middle. So the aesthetics, the digital native car and the practicality of those storages that makes a full complete experience on board basically. Well you now know more about the design of the new Megan E-Tech Electric. If you want to go further in the discovery, I invite you to the live chat in October.